Hey, what's going on everybody? So today we're gonna do something a little different. Uh, I do have a lineup of the old school Takumar uh, lenses and uh, they're all M42 mount. So let's find out what to do in regards to mounting an M42 to a Pentax K-mount camera. One thing to keep in mind, if you're gonna do this, make sure that when you get the M42 to K-mount adapter, you get the genuine Pentax adapter. There is a difference. The aftermarket ones, um, even though they are significantly cheaper, they do have a slight flange on them, so they do not actually mount flush to the K-mount lens mount. Um, that causes a problem. Uh, you won't be able to actually shoot at infinity focus. They just won't do it because the distance from the sensor has been changed, it's been altered uh, outside of the original design um, for how the lens will send the, whatchamacallit, uh, well I guess the, the circle of light. The circle of light! Um, anyway, so make sure you get the genuine Pentax adapter um, and I'll show you uh, how flush it actually does mount. It's a completely perfect flush mount right to the K-mount. It's beautiful! But anyway, uh, so with that said as well, you do not need, as long as you get the genuine Pentax adapter, you do not need any special tool to remove it from the mount. You can just use your fingernail or a ballpoint pen or a little flathead screwdriver. There's just a, l a little tiny tab you just press in and then it just comes out. You just twist, pull out. Uh, anyway, uh, enough of that. Let's get right to it. All right, so this is what the official Pentax M42 adapter looks like and uh, as I turn this around uh, try to keep this in focus here okay so this sits completely flush within the K-mount and you can easily tell it's an official Pentax one it just says Pentax and then Japan at the bottom and this little black thing here right here is actually the little tab thing that you would push down it's hard to see but push that in and then that will unlock this to come out of the K-mount. So uh, anyway, all right, let's uh, throw this onto, or throw a lens onto it, mount this to the camera body and then throw a lens on it. And if you look inside, you'll see the threads are there. So it, the lens screws directly into here and then it becomes a perfect fit. So let's see how that works. All right, so going to be using this lens, which is the Super Takumar 105 2.8, made in Japan. It's in beautiful condition. Nice, everything's nice and smooth. Can't even hear it. And we're gonna be shooting the frog. Okay, so first things first, uh, you have to remove the old lens, so let's do that. Obviously the little release button here, twist, pull this lens off, and you are left with just the mount, nothing but the mount. Get this focused there, all right. So left with nothing but the mount. Okay, one second while I put a cap on the, Bottom of this one. All right, there we go. Okay, now I am back. So how does this actually fit on? That's always the question. So let's get this in here. Just wanna make sure you guys don't miss anything and everything's nice and clear. Okay, so take the adapter. You've got the orange you can see that orange circle there. And you basically put it in. Now you have these two tabs. Just use your fingers. Twist and that's it. It doesn't lock, just twist. And you'll notice it is completely and utterly flush to the the lens mount. That's why it's very important that you get the original adapter. 
so that it actually fits properly. So now how do you mount the lens? Well, basically just take the lens and start screwing it in. If I could get the threads lined up properly, that would help. Oh, come on, there we go. And you just keep screwing and screwing and screwing. Remember, it is an M42 screw mount lens, right? So you have to screw it in. Pretty straightforward. Okay. And it is screwed in. There's no locking or anything like that. So, And remember, when you're using these lenses, you have to have the aperture on, uh, on manual. So always make sure that you have the aperture set on manual and you should be good to go because uh, it just won't work with automatic aperture set by the camera. So, all right, let's take a shot of the frog. This is going to be a short video. Um, oh, yes, right. Now I need to set the focal length. And unfortunately, 105 is not in here. And this is just to set focal length for uh, the shake reduction system. Uh, Go into live view. Let's get some focus on this bad boy. And that looks pretty good. I'm at F4. F4, 125th of a second ISO 1600. That's crazy. And if you want to make sure it's in focus, just press OK. It'll zoom this right in. So I want to focus on the eyes. And I should probably change the drive mode. So I'm using a remote. Actually I could use 10 second timer instead of going to find a remote. And very very carefully because this is a very very shaky tripod. Actually, I want to have this a little down. Like I said, it's a very, very shaky tripod. Reconfirm. Okay, looks good. That's pretty much all there is really to it. Um, no, just a very, very quick video. Show you guys what, it, how it all comes together. And yeah, that's really it actually. Uh, let me just darken this so you can see the actual image here. Put it in playback. And let me put it in no information display. Yeah, so it is a little warm in temperature. Uh, however, that's pretty good. Let's just zoom in. So, okay, there we go. See, the eye is perfect. And remember, that was at F4. And I am a fair distance away from this little guy. But that's really it. Uh, that's really all you need to know about mounting an M42 screw mount lens. Now, to get the lens off, let's actually do that. Okay, so to get the lens and everything off, what I was explaining before. So basically uh, and what you do is start with removing the lens. So just unscrew the lens from the mount. Believe me, it's a lot easier to do it this way. A lot easier to do it this way than removing the actual mount still attached to the lens. Or sorry, the adapter still attached to the lens because then it's really difficult to get it off with just your fingers. So you just unscrew the lens, put the caps and everything on. Give me a sec here. All right. And now all you need to do is this t one of these tabs. Just press down with your finger. And the battery on my camera just died. I thought I'd have enough juice, but apparently not. So after you twist, you just pull it out. 
And that's it. Easy peasy. So there you have it. How to use an M42 screw mount lens on your Pentax K-mount camera. You guys will see me on my next video. Oh, no. Yeah, you will. <laughs> All right. Peace.